Hello, this is Kate. This is my ninth and final sub game for the 2021 slash 22 rec league season. Today I'm playing for the teal team and I promise there will be many more shots compared with my final gold team game. Had a couple of fun stick saves at the end of the warm up there. Nice straightforward save to start the game off. Managed to get out on the angle really well here and Got just a piece of it with my blocker. Ideally would have liked to stay at the top of the crease there. One of my common phrases. Got to the post well for this quick shot off the face off. Definitely watching for the tip shot there. was definitely expecting a shot here. Luckily I got to the post fast enough. Pretty sure I already have more shots than I did in the last game and we're like halfway through the first period. <laughs> you won't catch me complaining though because games with lots of shots are way more fun for me, that's for sure. Not only were there a lot of shots, there were a lot of almost shots. And a lot of attempted tip shots. This school, honestly, I was pretty frustrated with myself over. I just had a really poor transition into the RVH and I left my armpit open for her to fit the puck right in. If I had done it properly, either I would have just made the save or I would have forced her to try something else. It's nice to see me actively using my stick here. And even though I've had a lot of shots, I'm getting up quickly and getting to the top of the crease where I need to be. Really happy with this save and also how fast I tracked it and, you know, pounced on the rebound. And oh my gosh, could the puck pinball around any more at the end of that period? And that is the end of the first period. No idea why I chose not to get up that time, but it certainly made things exciting. <laughs> Another breakaway similar to the first. Pretty happy with my play on those. And the player that keeps getting breakaways is actually on my team this year, which is definitely nice. Certainly would have been preferable if I could have caught this First shot, instead of bobbling it up with the cuff. 
I was really confused uh, how the puck actually managed to get in, but once I was able to watch the footage, I could see it just it just squeaked in under the knee block before I could get it down. I am glad in this game that I'm getting over two passes really well, quickly enough to take away the angles before they get their shots off. I was definitely proud of myself for making that clean grab through all that traffic. Another tip shot that I was fortunately able to adjust for in time. And then the D bailed me out, clearing the rebound for me. This was another goal I was frustrated with myself over. I just, I keep my body facing up ice instead of turning to face the puck as she's going by me. So I give her the far side of the net to shoot at. And then I don't even have my blocker in front of me and it's just sort of trailing behind. And so that's helping me even less in this situation. So she's a good shooter and she absolutely took advantage of the space I was giving her to shoot at. Then I did the same thing on the other side, but luckily she missed this time. That spring off the post, though. And that's the end of the second period. I am at least doing very well on the tipped shots, because there sure are a lot of them. Covered all the gaps this time and uh, and even poked the rebound away. Doing a pretty decent job of either containing or clearing rebounds in this one. surprised by that shot is because I was. I thought that it was for sure offside and I was mistaken. That D taking all the shots from the point is also on my team this year. Fortunately for me. Tried to get a stick on that rebound as well, but there's just a few too many sticks in the way. Definitely should have caught that one, but my glove can be ornery at best. So many almost shots. That one roofed so fast I lost for a second. Oh, and that tip was outrageously good. It was so close. Almost completely flubbed that pass, but at least I had the right idea and did get it there. Definitely room for improvement, though. That's a solid save there. Nice one. I can trap them against my chest successfully.
technically should have got a whistle for that one because it did uh, kind of go off my mask and then my shoulder. But, uh, you know, cleared the zone. So I'll take that instead. And that is the end of the game and the end of the 2021-2022 rec season. All I have left for the fall winter of 2021-2022 is the playoffs for the Vipers. And then after that, I have a summer season from 2022 uh, to follow those. It was definitely nice to come into this game after the last one and actually get a ton of shots. It's always really fun for me. I was a little frustrated over a couple of the goals, but ultimately I think I played really, really well, uh, regardless of those, you know, couple of mistakes. That's always going to happen. Uh, but I think I did a really good job on all the other, all the other stuff coming at me from every angle, and all the tip shots and wraparounds and breakaways. <laughs> it was very eventful, and I had a really good time. With that said, thanks everyone for watching, and I'll see you next time.